man, I feel just like a rock star. Hey everyone, welcome back to the NASCAR Thunder 2004 PS2 Career Mode Season 3 Let's Play, ladies and gentlemen. Right now, I'm about to do race 10 of 36. Going to California Speedway in Fontana, California for the running of the Auto Club 500. Last race was at Martinsville, and it was just back to hell. Oh my god, that was rough. Got 30th in that race. After I won two straight wins, and then go to Martinsville, I finished 30th. So, I was not really happy about that performance. I dropped down the 10th in points. We'll just see how it goes. Uh, let me show you team management. Um, building chassis number 7 for 6 more races and overhauling chassis number 4 for 2 more races. Um, building engine number 8 for 6 more races and overhauling engine number 7 for 1 more race. And then bodies. Building body number 8 for 4 more races. Overhauling body number 7 for 1 more race. Uh, so... Yeah, the stuff that I used at Martinsville, I beaten it up pretty bad. After I finish overhauling the other stuff, I'm definitely going to overhaul this stuff down here. And then I might sell them soon once the all the other stuff is being done, built. Uh, Shock Dino comes in three more races. So there's that. Uh, let's go right in the race. My primary sponsor is gone. I think their contract was up. Yeah, I'm going to have to sign a new one. I didn't notice that, too. Wow. All right, primary sponsor. What do we got? Oh, wow. Finish in fifth place. Qualify in tenth place. Finish ahead of Ricky Rudd. So that's a lot of money right there, actually. Holy crap. Oh, that's this one of those uh, prestige kind of sponsors, huh? Boy. I'm not sure if average finish in tenth. I feel like I could get average finish in tenth. And then finish in 10th place. Oh, I don't think I'm this material yet. Should I try it? I mean, it don't hurt to try it. I might as well give it a try. Uh, you know what? I'll try it. And if all fails... Oh! <laughs> oh. oh my gosh! I might as well give it a try, right? And like I said, if all fails, then it is what it is, you know? Holy shit. <laughs> oh, man. That 99 Aaron's Dream Machine. You know what? You got to give it a try, right? Like I said, if all fails, I won't do it again. So wait, what is it again? I have to uh, finish in fifth place. Qualify in 10th place, finish ahead of Ricky Rudd. I feel like I could get two. <sighs> Gotta give it a try, right? That's all you can do. Try it out. Alright, so chassis number 5, engine number 6, and body number 6. And it's a car rating of 66. Not too bad. I'm excited for this race. But let's just see what happens. Let me get on the qualifying first and see where I'll start. Off turn number 4 here. California Speedway, 39.87 on the first lap, 43rd right now. Definitely faster in the second lap. Really? That's, I was a second and a half faster and I still got 20, oh lord. I'm going to lose this 99 Aaron's Dream Machine right away. Oh, let's see, where does Ricky Rudd start? Oh, 18th. <laughs> Damn it. I'm just giving it a try, guys. I mean, if... If worst case scenario, I go back to the 82 car. <laughs> so, uh, let's get right on into the race. We're in Fontana, California, home of the California Speedway for today's Auto Club 500. It's another great day for racing. Pit strategy could be a major factor in this race, Barney. Well, you're right. Fuel mileage is a big concern for a lot of teams. All the green flag racing means they'll have to be very careful when they decide to pit for fuel. Jeremy Mayfield experienced an up-and-down year in 2000. He had 12 top 10s and 4 poles, but also had 11 DNFs. He was either running up front with the leaders or taking an early exit. Those wins are great, but each DNF is exactly the opposite and can take a driver out of a points race real quick. The Aaron's Rent Chevrolet wants to get things started off on the right foot for his new sponsors. Yeah, it's important to produce good results for your sponsors, especially when they're new. They want to see that they made a good investment. 
Chase Montgomery really hasn't qualified too well this year. When you're always starting in the back, it puts extra pressure on the driver and the team. You constantly have to be on your toes looking for that next position and watching out for wrecks. If you qualify poorly, it makes it that much harder to even have a good finish. The engines have fired and then the cars are rolling off pit road here at California Speedway. Ryan Newman and Rusty Wallace on the front row. Let's get this race here at California Speedway underway. Going to complete the first lap here at California Speedway, trying to move up through the field. We'll just see how this race goes to see if I made a mistake or not getting this uh, 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 Aaron's rent car, the number 99 car. Gosh. And we'll see how this new equipment is too, because I'm really curious what it's maybe be like in the long run. Alright, up to 20th. Now, one of these sponsor objectives... Actually, I'm ahead of Ricky Rudd. I'm actually ahead of one of my sponsor objectives is to finish ahead of Ricky Rudd. Uh, my other sponsor objective is to finish in the top 10. So, we'll see how that goes. We'll just see. Car seems to be, seems to be handling okay, you know? I mean, it's not too bad. Okay, Robbie going, you would think you'd give me room since you're one of my allies, but you're not doing that. The 31 car is outside. You know what race I'm also looking forward to uh, coming up in this, on the schedule? It's in a couple races. It's uh, Lowest Motor Speedway. I did well there last time. Could have finished uh, third in that race last time, so good expectations that I could maybe have a shot to win there. Oh my god! Car, car, car! Wow! Holy crap, car! Car got sideways going the corner. Okay, Ricky Rudd, no, stay behind me. One fish ahead of you. This car is alright on speed, but I, I expect a little bit better on the speed, honestly. I think I made a huge mistake going for this 99. Like I said, worst case scenario, I'll be back in my 82 car. But you gotta give things a try, you know? Oh, oh, what the? Come on, McMurray, hit the gas! Golly, he's going so slow, and now I'm a rival with him, which I don't want to be. When is that? When is that? Thank you. I was like, when is that going to shrink? Oh, my God. Oh, Ricky Rudd's blowing up! Ricky Rudd, Ricky Rudd blew up! Oh, please, don't come down in front of me. Wait a minute, don't... Don't do that! Oh my gosh! Well, there's one of my sponsor objectives right there. So one of my sponsor objectives, I'm gonna finish ahead of Ricky Rudd. <laughs> wow! All right. Well, that's easy to get one sponsor objective. Now my other one's to try to finish in the top ten, which, based on, come on, McMurray, move. McMurray's starting to annoy me right now. Just hogging up my lane. Yeah, I didn't get a sponsor objective of qualifying in fifth. But another sponsor objective is to finish in ten. Move, McMurray! Oh my, I'm about to knock this guy into the wall. 
he doesn't get out the hell out of my way. I don't understand why he keeps mirror driving me. He's holding me up. That's why I'm not going anywhere, because he's holding me up. Why is he staying on the bottom lane? That's what upsets me, damn it. Oh my god, I didn't even know Tony Stewart was up there. Oh my god. There's Ricky Rod. Sorry, Tony, I didn't know you were up there. I thought that was clear. Oh my god, get out of here. Move! Good lord, finally got around McMurray. Had to make it so difficult on me. I'm up to 16th. I just wish this car had a little bit more... It's got good speed down the straightaway. I'll give it that much. It's not showing much in the corners, though. Alright, well, I'm in the top 15. I just hope my pit crew has a good stop. Like, a good pit stop. That's all I want. track just a little bit kind of my fault oh man could have clearly got around Kurt Busch trying to get back underneath them which I do oh wow that was a close call up to 14 I'll be pitting a couple of laps. This car seems to get tighter on the long run. Sterling Marlin's out of the race. Look at the interval. Sterling Marlin, who is second in points coming into this race. Wow. All right. Well, there's another position I gained. Wow, Tony Stewart's coming. He was bound to show up sooner or later. Yeah, car is just getting tight. As soon as I hit the center of the corner, that's when it gets tight. Tony Stewart just blew by me and Kurt Busch. Who's this I'm gaining up on? Oh, it's Jeremy Mayfield, okay. Yep, they are. Ooh, okay. Not pitting yet. I'll probably pit next time by. Alright, well, I'm in the top 10 as of right now. Alright, I'm low on fuel. Pitting this time by. I'm not all too bad through 1 and 2. It's just 3 and 4 has been my problem. But I am going to pit this time by. I would gamble and take two tires here, but... Ugh, I'll get blown by. I would just take it easy. Alright. Uh... Yeah, let's, let's loosen up this car a little bit more. Actually, no, I'm okay with it. 16.6 second pit stop. I won the gamble and take two tires, but I don't want to. I don't want to risk it, risk it. I could drop back so fast if I do that. All right, pit crew, you've done really well the last three races. Let's pick up the pace here in this one. Four tire change. Also put in two cans again. Four tires again. 
14, 15. Okay, a tenth faster than their estimated time, so still good pit stop. Oh, great, I'm behind McMurray again. He's going to give me more hell. Well, we'll see how I end up after all this cycles through. All right, I might be able to get around McMurray. Never mind. Good. I don't want him to be in front of me. some more cars down pit road. Ten laps to go. Only ten laps left. Number ten, now left. Gain another spot. Alright, I'm gonna be in fourteenth. That's not too bad. Coming up on cars exit. Not too bad right now. We'll just see how the long run goes. Definitely gonna get by Elliot Sadler. I got Terry Labine gaining up on me pretty quickly. This is for 13th right here. I was 13th before the pit stop started. Now that looks like where I'm going to be. Okay, so not too bad. Yeah, I'm actually glad I didn't do the two-tire strategy for this. Um, it was a good call by me. Do you need fresher tires for this track? Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to get a top 10, guys, but it's going to be close. I'm pulling away from Terry Labine all of a sudden, which is good. Let's see, who's ahead of me right now? Rusty Wallace and Mark Martin. All right, Joseph. Good job hitting the wall on the straightaway. Holy crap, was I sideways going into that corner. You know, honestly, I should have, I'm having two thoughts in my mind right now that whether this was a good or a bad idea to have this uh, Aaron's Dream Machine sponsorship uh, right now. If anything, I should have maybe also waited on it uh, for next time and maybe if I happen to do a season four of NASCAR Thunder 2004, wait till then but but then I'm like nah this might be okay because there's some tracks coming up on the schedule that I'm gonna be good at like Richmond I was decent at Lowsmere Speedway I'm really looking forward to is another mile and a half racetrack like uh, Atlanta and Texas and if it wasn't for the um, the mistake coming on the pit road at Atlanta Motor Speedway I would have easily had a top 10 finish there. But then I got the win at Tex Motor Speedway, so I'm just looking at tracks like that. Well, I'm pulling away from the guys behind me, but I'm not gaining on anybody in front of me, which is kind of a shame. Five laps to go here at California Speedway. Right rear's getting worn. Take it easy out there. 
gaining on Michael Walter just a little bit. I ain't gonna get up to him in time to pass him. So 13th might be all I get for this race, guys. Which is another top 15 finish. Like I said, I've been consistent with getting top 15 finishes. Including the two wins I have. I don't seem to show up in qualifying a lot. But I do for the most part in the race. Who's that coming up behind me? Is that Kurt Busch? He's gaining on me, actually. Yep. Something I have to keep an eye out on. Drove it down the corner way too hard. I'm okay with the tires. Man, I'm going to have to try to hold off a of Kurt Busch if I want to finish 13th. War Burn is coming too. Two to go. Two to go. You know, I expected a better finish than this, especially when I had good equipment for this race. I expected better. Kind of disappointed I'm not going to have a shot at a top 10 finish, honestly. Oh, I know he's right behind me. I'm going to try to hold, up, hold him off as best as I can. Well, I did pretty well through this corner. Alright, last set of corners. Yep, and I'm going to hold... Looks like I'm going to hold off Kurt Busch. Ooh, wait. Yep, I'm going to hold him off to finish 13th. It's all right, but I expect it a little bit better. Dale Jarrett wins. I expect it a little bit better, honestly. Not a single caution lap was running the whole. But nothing much I can do. This way, this. Um, I only got 369k. Oh yeah, I forgot. I yeah. All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. My mother came into the room. Um, anyways, um, so. That was California Speedway, ended up 13th. Uh, let's look at the standings right now. Uh, Dale Jarrett leads it by 57 points over uh, Jeff Gordon. That was his second win this season as well. And I'm still in the top 10 in points, 215 points back, though. But I'm still there, so that's good. Uh, team management, let's see what's going on now. Yep, got some new stuff. I probably want to save the 100 per uh, the high stuff for uh, Charlotte, though. I don't think I'm gonna use it for uh, ooh, this one. I'm gonna. This one's gonna need some work. Sixty. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna need some work on these. It's only gonna bring me up to. Yeah. It's okay. It's okay. Wait, actually, hold. Actually, no, 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 no. Let me do that. Okay. Okay, I'm good with what's going on with that. Okay, so... Two more races till the sh uh, Shock Dino comes in. And there you go. Yep, next race going to be at Richmond, guys. Again, with this 99 Aaron's Rent. We'll see how it goes. I will see you at Richmond International Raceway.